Allotments are such a great way to build positive well-being and to generate a you know a good source of um a good source of calm. I think you know people who fail to realize allotments are a rarity in a lot of places and access to such important green space is only a good thing. And we're trying to promote that that positive sense of well-being, that that teamwork, and most importantly, a desire to get outside your front door and seize the day and you know. Carpe Diem as they say, sees the potential in your local community and that's what it's all about. I'm Louis, I'm an outreach support worker for the resettlement service. So today we're at the allotment. This is our allotment that we got um, in unison with the local council. This whole space here has been dug up and planted by um, our families. This whole space is going to be spinach, legumes, a variety of different um, vegetables and fruits that our families from from the likes of Syria had decided to decided to grow. Um, the, the beauty of this is that this is all going to be made up of different um, different produce. So it's not just going to be your standard cucumbers. They're going to have they've got um, you know seeds from local shops, local areas. They source these materials themselves and they're going to grow a bit of a bit of culture really. And when we started our project, as you can see, there's an allotment over there. It initially looked like that, which is a bit chaotic. We had to navigate a series of different challenges to get it set up and then we managed to get this all cleared. So this is how our project so far. We have a shed at the back. We have four um, compost bins. We have a little fencing here and we have you know, a few bits. We have a, a variety of different tools that the families can use. A long-term goal is to get something set up like that, which is a, you know, a crazy project, which would be you know, a long-term goal, but that's, we have three years to get this set up. So there's no rush at all. The major thing is to get the families working together and to build it. If you see that space for the, you have a bathtub, which, you know, who knows how a bathtub ends up in an allotment? But that space over there is going to be our um, communal space. It's going to be a bench, just a bit of area to chill out with, really. And um, yeah, that's the long-term goal. 